hallelujah glory to god this is prophetic intercession with a male you are welcome oh it's a privilege to come your way with a prophetic message from god i always say that i don't believe in coincidences if god led you to this channel it should be for a reason and my prayer is that you're going to stick around long enough to know why god sent you here in jesus mighty name amen your name is the problem don't call your don't call yourself a failure <clears throat> if that has been your confession you've been saying that you failed in doing this you failed in doing that no don't call yourself a failure call yourself an unfinished project an unfinished project because there is more to your life than what you see there is more when Rachel was dying she named her last son Benoni which means pain I it means pain and Benjamin said no you cannot call my child by what you are going right now you cannot call my child pain because the child is taking away your life. We've got to change this name. We are calling this child Benjamin. Benjamin. Sometimes don't 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 always conclude on your situation and tell you and tag yourself with a negative experience. Do not say this is what always happens to me. Do not say I'm the unfortunate one. That is a name you're giving yourself. That's an identity you're giving yourself. When you say I'm always unfortunate, good things hardly come in, uh, happen to me. I'm never, um, I've never had the right relationship, or I'm, I'm, I'm never going to have. You already put an, an identity to yourself, which is not supposed to be so. You know, you know, your name talks about your identity. Your name talks about your identity. And when you start giving yourself a negative identity, it means you're giving yourself a personality. You're giving yourself a name. And God says that is the problem. Don't call yourself a failure. Don't call yourself pain. Don't call yourself unfortunate. If you must give yourself a name, tell yourself you are a blessed child. You are a chosen generation. You are a royal priesthood. That is what the Bible says. You are a peculiar person. You are a royal priesthood. You are a chosen generation those are the kind of names you should call yourself hallelujah change your mindset change your perspective and things will be start changing for you in jesus mighty name amen